Hello guys, just a quick stop here to say hi and to share some health benefits of fevergrass, what is commonly known as lemongrass. Remember last week we were talking about heart issues, we were talking about how we can prevent heart issues, their causes, and ways that we can actually minimize heart issues from happening. From. And I did mention that if you have ideas that you can share so all of us can learn, you just leave it in the comment section. So last week, I, uh, after that video, actually, one of our fans contacted me and told me that she got heart issues and has been recommended fever grass, lemon grass. And this has actually been helping her so much. This is something that I consume like every day. If not every day, I would say every other day. But guess what? I've never taken time to look into its benefits. So when um, she mentioned that to me, I'm like, oh, let me do some research and just come up and share. And you know what? I have an aunt who loves fever grass so well. She always encourages us to take fever grass, to drink fever grass anytime, especially when we have fever. The truth is, each time I take this, I feel relaxed. It's, it's just a different feeling. So that's why I decided to come to share with you. So in today's video, I want us to talk about the advantages of lemongrass. Quickly show how I prepare my dry fever grass. I learned we can have this in like in superstore. I'm not too sure. I've never bought the fresh one or in Asian stores. For those of us who are back home, we have this as plants around our houses. So check that out and make sure you consume it. But before I get into these tips, I just want to seize this opportunity to acknowledge the presence of my subscribers. And I do appreciate all you do. If you're new here, I say welcome. And please subscribe, share, like, and don't forget to hit that notification button so you get more of these health tips each time I upload a video. So now I'm just going to quickly show you how I prepare my dry fever grass. I got this from my sister. I still have some left in the house. So if you know where I am or you live close by, feel free to stop by to get some. Watch with me what I do and we are going to dive right away into the health benefits after the demonstration. Okay guys, here is my lemongrass and uh, you can see some lemon besides. I usually just love to squeeze some small amount just to add flavor to it. After the water must have boiled for about 5 minutes or so, I'm just going to add my dry fever grass and let it boil for another 5 minutes. You will actually see the color changing. Look at that, the aroma is just unbelievable. And uh, I'm going to transfer it into this thermos because I am a tea lover. I would take this slowly during the day. And uh, look at this color. Very, very nice. Then what I do sometimes, I just add some honey just so it tastes good. If you really don't like sugar, that's it, guys. Okay, so let's share some health benefits now. Firstly, it is a great source of vitamins and minerals vitamins like a b c uh, folate and minerals like potassium magnesium zinc iron and all those things that the body actually needs to be able to function properly secondly fever grass reduces anxiety most of us when we take a regular hot tea we feel relaxed but with fever grass in addition to this relaxing property that it has it also helps to reduce anxiety. Trust me, as I mentioned, when I take fever grass, I feel different, amazing. You, I don't just know how to explain the feeling, but it's usually really just so good and relaxing. Another advantage of lemongrass is that it lowers cholesterol. We know how high cholesterol can be very dangerous to our system, to our health, especially those with heart-related disease. It is proven that if you take lemongrass in large quantity, it can go a long way to reduce the level of cholesterol. But my quick advice here is to always touch base with your doctors, with your physician, especially those who have heart issues, blood pressure issues. Always touch base to get advice 
from your physician before consuming lemongrass. Also, lemongrass prevent infection. Study results is actually showing that if you consume lemongrass, it will minimize the chances of you getting any infection, especially those whose immune systems are compromised. For example, something like thrush. Thrush is what we have, the accumulated stuff that we have on, on our tongue over time. So consuming lemongrass will actually help you to prevent uh, incidence of thrush. Also things like fungi, those whose immune systems are weak. If they consume fever grass or lemongrass, they will minimize any chance of having any fungi infection. And yes, when we talk about uh, immune systems being compromised, I think this is just a good time for everybody to try fever grass amidst this pandemic, COVID-19. What about boosting our oral health? This is a feed benefit of lemongrass. And uh, in most countries where this, is, this plant is native or common, most people actually chew the stock as a way to improve their oral health and their dental health. And this goes a long way to inhibit any bacterial growth. Lemongrass also is a pain reliever. It is proven that if you drink the lemon tea, it is actually going to minimize the chances of someone sensing pain. Boosting the red blood cells level is another benefit of lemongrass. This is a study a result of 2015 that suggested that if you consume lemongrass tea for some time, like 30 days, it's going to increase the concentration level of hemoglobin and increase the red blood count in the system. Consuming fever grass again will go a long way to relieve you from getting bloated. This means uh, fever grass got some diuretic effect. It can help you to lose water. But you want to be careful. It is only beneficial, lemongrass is only beneficial here if water retention is causing bloating and making you feel uncomfortable. You know, as systems, we need water. You don't want to lose water to the extent that you get dehydrated because that is going to be another problem on its own. Lemongrass also help to relieve spasm, especially the lemongrass uh, essential oil. And for digestion, that relaxes the muscles of your stomach and helps with digestion. One thing I would like to mention here is that systems are different and what works for me might not necessarily work for you. So I always advise that if you try things out and they are not working, always consult with your doctor. And this is the end of the video, guys. I am pretty sure that you love these tips, you love these health tips. Go ahead and share. And if you haven't subscribed, why not do it now? This is the right moment. And don't forget to hit that notification button like I mentioned earlier, so that you don't miss out on any of these health tips. Thank you again for watching and make sure you share your own benefits of lemongrass in the comment section. It was nice to have you again on this platform. I wish you all the best. Enjoy your lemongrass, feel relaxed, feel happy. Let's all age happily. I will talk to you soon.